Martin 117GW. We are here at Black River Paintball in Fayetteville, so really not far from home. And we're gonna go over a couple different things today. First of which, the high speed gear leg panel. What this essentially kind of was derived off of was the original Costa rig. And the biggest thing that people were kind of looking for is how to make the Costa rig modular. Because as you guys know, the Costa rig is kind of a, a, a one built all package. You know, as, it basically ships as it is. Uh, you can't modify it, you can't change it. Uh, but it's really purpose built. Uh, what the leg panel does is give you the platform that the uh, cost rig uses, but with the modularity by being able to put whatever tacos you want on it, whether it's double tacos, you got the little kangaroo style setups where you have you know the pistol or a multi-tool pouches on top of rifle setups. And as you can see, the uh, leg panel is wide enough for you to mount three rifle mags. Uh, I talked to Andrew Pagan from uh, High Speed Gear and this is actually one of the setups he runs now. Likes a lot. And definitely what's great because I typically run more of a rifle setup so you're gonna carry that one extra mag and it's as as you can see it's one of those uh, systems where it's you know nice and high so basically it doesn't it doesn't ride low on the leg or on, on the thigh or anything like that so it's pretty much right where you need it and if you go to reload it's pretty much you know perfect spot per, uh, perfect position definitely one of the things I like about it and it's really affordable too if you have a bunch of tacos uh, just like he and I had and we we're trying to figure out what to do with them um, you can pick up the panel for it's like 60 bucks, you know, 59 bucks or something like that. And uh, just, you know, slap those extra tacos on there. And now you have a fully built, purpose built platform for you to use at the field where you're doing real steel, doing a force on force training, using airsoft or whatever have you really. So, or if you're just going hunting, I mean, cause the tacos, they really work, uh, they work for just about anything. But as you can see, it really goes well with the whole kit and it kind of, as a sub load, it kind of accents what he currently has, allows him to carry a couple, well, a couple more mags and a couple more tools that he needs for the fight. I would typically recommend, I know his is mounted a little bit more forward, but I kind of recommend uh, shifting it so it's a little bit more to the side, so it kind of uh, stays a little bit offset a little bit. But definitely a really nice setup. Uh, definitely uh, going to be checking this out in the field, but we're going to get his opinion uh, after he starts using it. But uh, thank you guys for watching. Spartan 117 GW, and this is a high speed gear like panel. guys, Spartan 117GW here and uh, we just finished up filming the video for the leg panel, the high speed gear leg panel. A uh, really opportune time to talk about the Costa rig because they are so similar. As you can see, I have mine urban gray. I typically run it with my wolf kit or when I go to the range. I mean, mine's actually got a pretty good use out of it. It's actually pretty beat up, but uh, that's one of the things I love about it. It's very ruggedized. It's very uh, ut utility, uh, very utility I guess you could say uh, definitely love how it can hold two mags and uh, also you can have you know the a multi-tool or a knife or something like that in there as well uh, but I've used it at work I've used it at the range um, I've used it you know while I'm playing airsoft it's a really good system and that's one of the things I like how how high it rides on on the uh, close to the core of the body and how um, it's kind of very purpose-built it's very purpose-built uh, obviously it was designed by a uh, you know, a bunch of guys at High Speed Gear and Cost had some input on as well. And I believe uh, one of my buddies, Tony Patton, I had some input on as well. Uh, but it's a really nice system that kind of accents, you know, a uh, higher speed uh, kit in terms of uh, having just what you need. With a system like this, in some ways you really wouldn't need a battle belt. Uh, but that's what's definitely great about it too. Even if you're just going to the range, uh, just doing a, cu a couple quick drills, something like this holds just the right amount of, uh, amount of ammunition if you're running a couple drills, but doing barricades or if you're doing, you know, just a couple like, um, three gun or something like that because obviously you have your pistol mags on here as well but as you can see it's very you know low profile there you know doesn't add too much to the body and you know i really love the kit itself so make sure you guys check out the high speed gear costa rig uh it's about 139 bucks it's a good little investment to make a couple different colors uh, anywhere anywhere between tan and urban gray so make sure you guys check it out it's spartan 107 gw thanks for watching I'm James C. Burns, I play Sergeant Frank Woods in Call of Duty Black Ops 1 and 2. It's time for you to subscribe to Spartan 117GW, baby. Elite Force BBs, that's what's in my mag. Thanks for watching.